Hey guys, you girl Chris Corio here and welcome back to my vlogging for Trinidad Carnival 2023. Yes ma'am, this is me prepping to go mad the people them because a Jamaica I take Trinidad Carnival, I'm not, ask, I'm not ask Christ. I'm not asking him because he alone is the one who tell me when I was in my sleep. Jamaica is taking Trinidad Carnival 2023. We don't like that bite that blood. Anyway, so I warmed up on a step of five minutes and now I'm doing range of motion exercises for my back, for my hamstrings, for my glutes. Girl, you need to see my glutes and then I get nice and round and sexy, you see? <laughs> By the way, I told you guys that I was going to let you guys know if I was going to go back to meat, lean meat, like chicken breast and them something there, rice and them something there, yeah girl. So no more vegetarian coming no one look too lean, more look nice and thick and ch more mad them say. This is a cat cow movement and I'm going to be intensifying it a little bit more or not intensifying but focusing a little bit more to the upper back versus the mid back which is what i was doing a while ago this is third the needle it's excellent so those of you who just go in and just do like a regular warm up on a treadmill no nah, these are nice like especially that counter rotation i just did that what i just did now is a ql walk this is a hip rotation so both of them including this straight leg raise that i'm doing right now currently are excellent for opening the hips and preparing me for the movements that i'm going to be doing so right here come always setting me up to do a single leg squat which is excellent for stabilizing proprioception work we're doing here guys pure science strength training because my one gets stronger so i can lift heavier so anyway i'm stabilizing bulletproofing my ankles my knees my hips but, oh if i think about it because my girl at girl at girl can't drop in a gym in a boom bam radam I did that, yeah girl, and you can do it too. You can start on the flat though, because initially we had started with like two discs and then we worked our way up to four discs. So, excellent stuff. Now this here is a shoulder dislocation exercise. You're actually not dislocating your shoulder, you're just warming up your shoulder joints. Right here now, Kamau is setting me up to do deadlifts. Now, initially we used to be over on the squat bars. You see, if you look over to the right, you see where the, the, the thick man, the nice thick man over there, so in I corner, I hide himself. That's Jeremy, guys. Big up, tough boss. Right over there, so where he is doing his um, tricep. I think that's tricep shrugs he's doing. Yeah. You see the bar is going across. So this bar that's on the ground now, it used to be on top of those. So I used to be lifting it or doing a rack pull from a higher space, like right above my knees. Like now I've, I've gotten stronger. I've gotten the technique a little bit better. And so we're trusting myself, both of us trusting Chrissy to, to go from a lower floor. Right? So that in itself is progress. So lifting from off of the ground, off of two plates. The progression from this is literally to be lifting or pulling from off of the ground. Now, of course, there's sorry, my point out say fill up your belly with air, the Valsalva maneuver. I'll drop a link right here where you can check out the Valsalva maneuver. It actually helps you to fill your lungs, fill your chest, um, increasing the pressure so that you're able to lift um, a lot more efficient. I'm going to drop a thick egg, girl, guys. Mm -hmm. You know, say, you know, say, at girl, bad girl, for wine and broke out in between sets. Yeah, there you go. There you go. And you said, the young man, did the, he did the one dancing, but I'm going like, you know, one dance. But anyway, the music is sweet, but I can't put it because I can't bother with YouTube and the copyright and the copyright strikes. I enjoy the little piece of cheap free music on my have until somebody is willing to contribute to me. A nice, sweet playlist for Chris Corio's tutorials every Tuesday. I see you, baby. Email me right below. Right here, so I'm lifting 165 pounds. Now, this is a big deal for me. Um, I'm not going to say it's as far as my personal record because I'm still learning the technique and I possibly could have lifted heavier. But just, just FYI, I am 140 pounds. So this is me lifting heavier than myself. Of course, Jeremy, tough boss, him come over to come check out what's going on because you don't know him I like the king of powerlifting in Jamaica. Don't know. Boom. Yeah bare motivation are going right here so come always over to the side it might give me motivation but we can't play it we can't make it here because i bear music up in the background the music sweetest you guys are dancing i'm missing it girl let me tell you what my thing about this no okay girl make a talk about this oh god guys i don't know the lyrics i'm so terrible oh. <laughs> but no copyright strikes <laughs> so anyway right here we're actually getting into the meat of the matter what we were actually supposed to be doing was an upper body day but because Kamo and Jeremy they both have a powerlifting meet which is the day after this day or this night here um they wanted me to do the deadlift while they were there because 
homegirl now want move no heavyweight by herself so i needed them to be there to spot and to overlook and that's exactly what they did big up tough big up the team right here i'm just working out those rare delts triceps and over here now come on help me out nice and proper i'm gonna lean back here's a really nice technique you can utilize ladies if you're gonna be doing like a bench dumbbell press um i rock back if you have good strong core and you can just use the knees to kick the dumbbells back versus leaning back sometimes it hurts the shoulders without doing that actual movement to get into uh the position to do this exercise and i do have my arch remember i did a bench press video some time ago that yeah that show you about the arch and tell you why i did an arch which is stabilizing the shoulder joint and incorporating movement from the legs as well yeah so you can check out that video right here i'm doing lateral raises um moving some weight right there rounding out the shoulders as per usual guys what may i tell you now mom want look at and sexy you know for carnival mom want look at and sexy because i'm not got carnival since when i think i went 2018 i think was my last carnival or yeah 2018 because the pandemic was 2019 girl yes oh my god and i decided you know what i am literally call it a carnival virgin now because after about two three years of no carnival thanks to the dirty pandemic dirty covid covid corona i am going to officially break that virginity in trinidad that is my carnival right well that's on a little way not not my carnival virginity because i've been to like three four carnivals already but you know what i mean oh god overthinking this this is a face pull like, have you seen my face pull let's move on change the subject <laughs> so anyway this is working the rhomboid muscles that are the muscles of the upper back and also some rear delts rear, rear shoulders as well and some biceps as well but mainly the upper back uh, so the ladies would have tell me about oh your shoulders look nicey yeah i know them look good anyway right here so i'm doing a tricep pull or extension um i felt absolutely handicapped doing it just for the record um so not every movement feels perfect this is a bicep curl most persons know how to do this we do this every day like one of the things that i realize is that like our anterior body it's more natural doing movements there and here i am trying to tricep pull down again mm -hmm. 